what's good, y'all? This is your boy Supernatural J, and I check this out. I, I'm gonna say this real quick. I love y'all for the fact that y'all really watch my videos like that. I'm gonna try to make my spiritual talks a little bit shorter, honestly, because you know I know y'all got things to do, stuff like that. Nobody's always sitting down. You feel what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And you know it's low key boring, you know. But once I get up there, once I start getting more things I can do, then trust and believe, you know. I'm gonna start doing more things on my spiritual talk. I'm gonna start, you know, start being around nature more, you know. Just wait until I get better phones, better mics, all like that. Just wait, I right? Just wait. But check this out. But I want to say that this get, they don't take no vaccine. Don't take no vaccine. They are pushing. Listen. Biden first thing he said, the, he said, how you can, can control the coronavirus? This man said he's going to shut down farms and workers, which means that there's going to be mandatory testing. Oh yeah, and if you say no to the mandatory testing, you will not get you will not get paid and you will get sent home immediately, which means to hell with you, pretty much. All right, that's for one. That's for one. Two, they're trying to push that vaccine. They're trying to say, if you take this vaccine, you'll be straight. There is something in that vaccine, bro. Ninety percent. First of all, if why is it ninety percent? If y'all made the coronavirus, y'all should know exactly what to recycle. Y'all should know exactly what to recycle. You know what I'm saying? I should know exactly what heals it. Look on a Lysol spray bottle. It specifically says for COVID-19. That was all, COVID-19 was already thought of. Nobody just never thought about it. And you know how Lysol is jumping right now. Lysol is jumping. Lysol was meant for coronavirus, bro. It's meant for coronavirus. You, them niggas is jumping. Honestly, I, I should have worked for Lysol, my bro. I would have been a clean. I would have been fine to be a clean janitor. See, I would have been fine to be a janitor. See, that's tough. But check this out. Don't take no vaccine because you don't know what's in it. It's all about. It's all about what they want to push and they want to get that vaccine out so they control everything about you. Remember, if they was to, okay, let me put it like this. Per se. If you was to kill every single peasant, every single person in poverty on this world, everybody else will be rich. That means, you know, that means it's going to be boring. That means someone has to be at the bottom. Someone has to be, you know, used upon. Someone has to be, uh, someone has to be worthless. Someone has to be useless. Not useless, but, you know, to their eyes, worthless, useless. So that means that they're not going to kill you with that vaccine. Trust me, they're not going to kill you with the vaccine. They're not gonna kill you, you know what I'm saying? Now, I, now, there's a lot of conspiracy going through my mind right now, cause you, it's it's America, bro. It's a matrix, bro. You gotta think about it. It's a matrix, bro. But listen, I'm not worried about it, cause my energy is up there. My great, my my vibrations always been high, bro. It's always been high. I ain't been sad since '06, and I thank Yeshua for what He's doing for me. I ain't been sad in 06, my nigga. 06. Oh, I ain't been sad in a long time. That's how much exaggeration. Yeah, I might get frustrated at sometimes about doing stuff like that, but yo, I've always been happy. I don't care who. And people might try to get me mad, like these teachers, these parents, and stuff like that. They might are uh, based off school, because the devil knows. School is the best way to get to me. The best way. He knows that. In, he knows, bro. I might, I'm not even gonna put my business out there, but he knows certain things that's gonna get me. You feel me? He knows certain things that it's hard for me to get through, and I'm trying to get through it right now. You see what I'm saying? If I get those two things straight, then it's over. It's over. That's why when I tell my team, but well, not my team, but when I tell y'all, don't think that. See, that's what ch I hate church for. You know, at the end of the um, prayer, they talk about if you want to give your life to God now, you come on, come to the altar, and I'll pray for you and stuff like that. You come out of church happy. You about to say, okay, I'm about to have a new start. I'm not going to do this no more. I'm not going to do this no more. I'm not gonna... That's not how it should be. Work on your problems one by one. If you don't, you're going to get hit. The devil's going to use every single problem that you have and put it in your face if you try to get all of them one. That's why I did one by one. I stopped listening to that gangster music. 
that really does mess with your mind. It messes with your energy. And it's sad to say that I found out at, like, you know, found out when the coronavirus is around, so I'm not around nobody no more, unfortunately. But that messes up your mind, bro. It messes up your mind. I, f- I have not listened to rap music like that. The only person I listen to is Lil Uzi Vert. And his, you know, his up music. It's up music, you feel me? It's theme type music. It's cool. You feel me? So I'm, you know, I'm chilling. But, how would I put it? But yeah, that means a lot. Dude, that music. So don't go one by one, man. Just chill. 